You've probably seen this guy before, maybe up on a wire or flying around town with about a hundred of his friends. It's a pigeon, or more properly, a domestic rock pigeon. Domestic rock pigeons come in different colors, patterns, shapes, and sizes. In all, there are over 350 breeds. People like to breed pigeons with specific combinations of characteristics. Pigeon fanciers show their birds at fairs. They fly their birds in races where the winners earn million dollar prizes. Some even write books. The first thing you need to know about pigeon breeding is that, just like people, pigeons can be male or female. Sex is determined by sex chromosomes. In people, they're X and Y. In pigeons, they're Z and W. Your first puzzle is to breed a female pigeon. To be a good pigeon breeder, you need to know how to pair birds to get offspring with just the right combination of characteristics. You need to know a lot about genetics. Inherited characteristics, like whether a pigeon has a crest or not, are the products of genes. Genes pass from parents, through eggs and sperm, to offspring. For most genes, offspring inherit two copies, one from each parent. The two copies can be the same, or they can be different. Different versions of the same gene are called alleles. The allele combination for a particular gene is called a genotype. The two alleles work together to make what we see, what scientists call a phenotype.
Some pigeons have featherless feet. Others have feet with short, fuzzy feathers. Breeders call this phenotype slipper. Slipper is an inherited characteristic. Often, breeders want birds with specific combinations of characteristics. Try your hand at breeding a pigeon with both slipper and crest. <laughs> 